Now with an Asian style option, it differs from a European style in one very significant way. With a European style option, the payoff is between the exercise price or the strike and where the market is observed on one specific day. With an Asian style, there's an element of averaging. What I mean by that is you compare the strike or the exercise price to the average of where the market has been over the previous one, two, three, six months. You determine that at the beginning. Now what it means is if on the day that the option matures, the market has spiked up, with a European style option, you could get caught up quite nastily. But with an Asian style option, because you have this element of averaging, any nasty spike up or down in rates or currencies or commodities gets averaged out. So the volatility of the payoff has gone down. So you'll normally be charged a lower premium for an Asian style option. Now this is sometimes used as well in the commodity markets where you hear about Asianing or equity markets or sometimes FX markets as well because maybe the balance sheet is measured against the average exchange rate during the year. So Asian style, cheaper.